In seventh grade, I was Justin Bieber for Halloween. Really? Yeah. Did you do a very fun? I didn't skate back He then. does. Keep him alive. I know. What's going on, guys? Ricky Glazer here. Today, we are out at the amazing Braille House 2.0. And, okay, so we're going to do some skating today. I'm going to try to do quite a hard trick. So I was perusing Instagram, and I saw a really cool thing. The homie blunted down a kink rail. Then he did ollie out, late back foot flip out. And now what I'm thinking is I want to learn it. I've never done it before. I've done some late flips out of grinds, but not this one specifically. I feel like it's going to be a fun challenge. We're going to start right here on this flat bar. See, the thing with these kind of tricks is you never know which way it will go. Will it be easy? Will it be extremely unbelievably hard? So if it's easy, maybe we'll take it to the down rail. If it's unbelievably hard, maybe we will cry and get very upset and throw our board. No, we won't do that. But maybe we'll be a bit stressed out and then we'll land it and be very relieved. So. I guess all we can do is really start. Maybe we'll, let's test the wax, do a couple blunts. And you know, the most important thing is we have some fun with it. That's what it's about, guys. Woo! That trick looks really fun. Yeah, see, I was gonna wax it, but that actually slid pretty well, but I think I'm still gonna wax it. <clears throat> wow, look at that cut. My persistence, my wax. Oh, <laughs> that needs to be on a shirt. <laughs> In general, with blunts, rails is a little different, but on a ledge, you can't ever have it too much wax. Leave it in the comments below. Have you ever had too much wax for a blunt? I don't think, the, I don't think you can. What do you think, Gabe? You ever done a blunt? No. One day, back blunt. I reckon you got it. Maybe, Look, right, maybe in a mini Right here, on this little gutter. You for sure got that. Oh All right. Gosh, dude, you are going in. I told you, you can't have too much. Woo! That see? was higher than an ollie on flat. Hey? That was higher than an ollie on but flat. But see, that's what I need. That hang time, and then you just... WWE Smackdown. So do you... So your plan is to ollie like that, and then once you level it out, you late flip? Yeah, so the thing with late flips, you gotta ollie high and get your feet away from the tails. And then when you're neutral, then you can smack it. Let me just do it. I, I think I was nervous, but now I feel like it might work pretty well. So let's try. <laughs> Damn, anyone got some wax? You're not good at blunts on rails, right? Uh, not really. My back foot always slips off. Frontside blunts like that could do, but backside, my foot, my back foot always just slips off. I don't know. Have you ever done nollie blunt on a rail? Frontside. That's so sick. It's a scary trick, but I want to do nollie hurricane. But I really want to see Ricky land his trick. That wasn't it, though. I flipped it yeah, with my front foot accidentally. Flip. Yeah. You only did a, a back blunt kick flip. No big deal. That's not the trick you're going exactly. for. Exactly. <laughs> All right. You know, uh, Carlos used to get a blowtorch and he would hold sticks of wax and he would melt the wax onto the ledge. Really? Yeah. That's not a bad idea. No, honestly. it was a great, yeah, it, it worked. I could definitely try that. God. See, it still sticks. I gotta really just get the timing and the slide down and then get a big pop. Hello, Dan. Woo! Woo! Dang. There you go. 
I reckon that was close, Ricky Glasgow. Yeah, that was that was feeling good. Woo! You want to go to your favorite place in the world for me at some point this week? Target. Wow, have that you ever really dolphin flipped out of that? That would be a cool one. Woo! Oh. Alright, but we need a bigger pop on that. You what? So like that was kind of close, but we definitely need a bigger pop and harder hit. Oh, oh the good. shin. That was real good. See, it doesn't look like a close attempt, but that was basically it. Wow. More lift. That was good there. How does he do that? Ah. That is higher. insane. I'm getting too focused on the flip. I gotta really remember to pop high. Hey, Ricky! Don't forget to pop high! What did you say to me? I said, don't forget to pop high. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You stop it, you. <laughs> you just stop. All right. All right, Glow. First try for you. Right here for Starbucks. How's your I'm almost there. Big cheek. <laughs> Go get a rock Almost to wall the face. Right next to my coffee and phone, my two favorite possessions. <laughs> oh my god! Oh! <laughs> Late shove would be sick too. Yeah. That was a little bit of both. Yeah, Ricky. I'm just crack. It's there. It's right there. Ew. That was it. Ricky, I might cry when you land that. Really? I might. Don't cry. We're like tears happiness, of joy. Happiness tears? Yeah, yeah. That was dangerous. Blunt Ollie North. That was dangerous because I was like, I'm bailing, I'm getting out of here. And then I was like, actually I'll land it. But then my foot was about to roll my ankle and I was like, oh, I should have bailed. You know, the proverb, it's like, if you're on the left side of the road, you're fine. If you're on the right side of the road, you're fine. You know, bail, land, all good. But you're in the middle of the road, not knowing if you're gonna bail or land, no good. That's not where you want to be. I've never heard that before. Really? Never. That's what I'm talking about. You! Flip in! Oh. Woo -hoo -hoo. oh, you're right there! Yeah. Oh! Oh, hey, hey. I was a bit off balance. I'm reaching the optimal level of excitement. Yeah. I just... You know there's a lot going on. You gotta be like, whoop, whoop. you gotta be like, whoop. and then you gotta, you have too much foot on it, only does half. You gotta have it right there. Right. Oh. I could get a little more height, a little more 
Haya. You. Oh, ah. it's there. Yeah. Right here, ten bucks. All right. Ten bucks. You. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, GC. <laughs> hey, when the money comes to the play, oh, that awesome. 10 bucks just... Ricky don't play. That's a, Woo! That's a bar. Oh. You know, learning new tricks is very stressful sometimes, especially when you really want to land it. So I'm hyped that I did it. That was pretty clean, right? I mean, my foot was a little bit wonky, but other than that, I'm pretty happy with how it flipped. Pretty stoked on it. What else do I want to say? See, there's a part, like, okay, look, one half of me is like, I'm very happy. That was amazing. Good job, Ricky. The other half of me is like, like why, why did you do money? this? Yeah, <laughs> I feel that. I haven't bet you since the freaking long rail outside. Yeah, and I, and I was like, that. yeah, it's been long enough. I'm good. I don't have to bet. <laughs> I, you know, if I bet him, it's fine. Yeah, but see, that was a mistake by my part. I, this is what I said. I was like, I got to start losing the bets. Get the prices up then that's when i strike yeah you should ask for 50. <laughs> but you know i'm just hyped to do it it's not about winning the challenge it's not about the money it's about the love of skating doing new tricks i love doing new tricks that's so i'm hyped new day new trick 21 years in like that's sick there are some videos right there subscribe like leave a comment below let us know what crazy tricks would you like us to see what would you like us to do in the braille house anything crazy you know i'm always down sounds good and we want you to learn how to skateboard we have everything you need at braille skateboarding dot com. We'll see you in the next one. Ow!